What's up, DFS players? Baseball is back. We have two double headers tomorrow, Tigers Athletics, Yankees Astros, and we are going to be going through the best player props on prize picks. So again, prize picks is a DFS platform and it is super interesting. And why is it interesting? It's interesting because any two player props you select into a two pick entry is just a parlay where you're getting plus 200 odds. And it doesn't matter what two picks you select. It doesn't matter if you take the overs or the unders. It's always going to be 20 to win 60 for any two player prop pick entry. Now this is completely different than sports books, right? Because sports books change odds depending on if you select the over or the under. On prize picks, that's not the case. It's fixed payouts, two picks plus 200 odds. Three picks is plus 400 odds. If you're going with a power play, 20 to win 80 in profit. And then four is just plus 900 odds, 20 to win 180 in profit. So we've gone through the math before, but essentially what this means is for any two pick entry, Price Picks is giving you the implied odds, implied odds of minus 137. So minus 137 implied odds for any player prop on prize picks. And you may be thinking, well, where's that coming from? And this is where it's coming from. So any two pick entry, you're getting plus 200 odds. So if we go ahead and we go to a parlay calculator, if you're getting each leg at minus 137, then your parlay comes out to plus 200 odds, right? So prize picks is just giving you the implied price of minus 137 on all of your player props for a two pick entry um, because they're always going to give you plus 200 odds on any two pick entry. So anyways, let's get into it. Let's go through the best player props for today. And I actually have a four leg entry. So sportsbooks have started to post odds for the upcoming day. And we can see there's already a player prop on prize picks available on the positive expected value betting tool on odds jam right this tool will literally just constantly scan prize picks the sports books to try to find you line inefficiencies so we can see right here pablo lopez under five and a half strikeouts in the marlins game is heavily juiced on the sports books so pinnacle and DraftKings are the two sports books that currently have odds for this wager and they're pricing this around minus 170 Right, so we're getting a ton of improvement on prize picks and you can quantify your profit margin mathematically and it's 1.96%. So this is the first incredible player prop you wanna be on on prize picks. Pablo Lopez under five and a half strikeouts. And again, as a quick plug, you know, I do recommend, if you haven't, you can join the Odds Jam Discord. So the Discord, there's a link in the description. There's a couple premium channels uh, for prize picks and for sports betting, but there's also a bunch of free picks that we'll give out. So you can check it out. Hopefully, hopefully you can find it useful as well as follow along with our profit and loss. So on prize picks, you know, we started this like six days ago, whatever. We're currently up 983 bucks. Started out a bit hot, but you know, currently a bit of a losing streak, let's just say in the WNBA. Anyway, still up money. So let's go ahead, let's get into it. So we already explained Pablo Lopez under five and a half is a great bet to include in your prize picks entry. Sportsbooks have it heavily juiced to the under. So this is a great you know prop that you can include in your prize picks entry. So that's number one. Now number two is if we actually just go to the odds for this game, we can see another line discrepancy. So all of the sportsbooks are heavily juicing John Gray's under six and a half strikeouts right they have the under around minus 135 to minus one you know 36 on prize picks we can get under seven so half of a strikeout higher in our entry right so this is another incredible player prop you want to be on on prize picks if there were seven strikeouts our bet on sports books would lose on prize picks we would push so the jump from six and a half to seven is pretty big so being able to get this in your prize picks entry is the second bet that i ended up going with then i also have um javier under seven very similar reasons and then i also have um carlos under seven so i have three unders in my prize picks entry and i'm placing half a unit on it so 50 bucks 
to win 500. Now that's a little misleading. It's 50 to win 450 in profit plus your stake back. So that's actually just plus 900 odds. And we're getting the implied price for a four pick entry of minus 128. So even better than um, a two pick entry. And there will be a video on the end screen if you're curious more about prize picks payouts, the math behind prize picks, how prize picks works. There will be a video on the end screen. But regardless, these are four player props you want to be on mathematically profitable DFS props for Thursday, um, July 21st. So go ahead, lock them in, and let's make some money.